What is going on guys, it's Aviation Addicts here and in today's video I am going to show you all how you can change servers on Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. This should apply to Flight Sim 2024 as well. Uh, I get asked this question all the time so I just thought I'd make a quick tutorial on how to do it. Uh, first of all you want to pause your simulator and it will take you to this screen here that you will all be familiar with. From here, you want to go up to your name tag on the right-hand corner, and you want to click on that. Now, if they are greyed out, it simply just means that you are not online. So I'm going to show you how to get back online. So you want to go to General Options. Once you're in General Options, you then want to go to where it says Data on the left-hand side. In Data, you will see where it says Multiplayer. Switch this on. Once you select this to on, you then want to click apply and save down on the bottom. Once you've done that, you then want to go back and go back to your name tag up on the top right hand corner. And you'll notice you will now be online. You can change the status to offline, busy or away. But below this, more importantly, multiplayer servers. So I'm on the North European server, you can select whichever one you wish. So let's say we wanted to change server to East USA. Simply click on that, and that is it. That, that's it, you've done it. Give it maybe 10 to 20 seconds to load you into the new server. Um, you may see name tags of other players disappear, that's normal, and new ones will appear. Uh, each server has obviously its own players that are flying around there, so yeah, that's how you do it. That's how you change the server. So pause your game, make sure you're online, go up to your name tag, and multiplayer servers. There you go. I hope you found this helpful. If you have found it helpful, then please make sure to drop a like. Also drop a comment on this video. If there's any other tutorial videos you would like to see me make, then do not hesitate to let me know, and I'll try my best to make that content uh, for you. Um, and yeah, make sure to subscribe to this channel. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you all in the next one, you guys.